thought we'd have a, a little look at those crazy videos we made erasing CDs with 240,000 volts. So 240 goes in there and 240,000 comes out the top. And when you spin a disc in the middle, the effects are quite good. Of course, getting an electric shock is the least of your worries. You've got other things to worry about, like ozone and x-rays. So, don't try it indoors. Let's have a look. Right, boys and girls, this is how you raise a CD. Lots of bolts. CD erased. We'll try that again with uh, possibly just a bit more grunt. Job done. Right, well on the next clip two spinning discs with three power levels and you'll see that on the last attempt I might have cranked the amps up just a bit too much. And of course, finally, it had to be done with a DVD. And by the way, after they've been through that little process, they don't play. It actually damages the lacquer on the surface and the data, if any on there, is totally corrupt. So it does work. And of course it doesn't affect the battery because it's not actually in the circuit or the motor. It's independent. So, I hope you enjoyed the videos. Catch you soon.